Hi, Cottonwood Cubs. We are sure getting close to March 29th when we will welcome back our TK kindergarten first and second grade students back on campus. I uh, wanted to make a video to show you how you'll get to your classroom, but also go over some quick announcements. Uh, first announcement is Chromebooks. We want to make sure all Chromebooks are charged the night before and in students' backpacks. Uh, they may be using it during the day. With that being said, all students should be able to log into their Chromebook independently at this point. They have their Clever Badge, which can help with those things. Please work with them so they know how to do that from the first day. Uh, students should also be able to log in to uh, resources like Imagine Learning. That's something that they'll need to be able to do independently. Um, our goal with that, obviously, is to minimize any type of contact with uh, staff and students. We do have the social distancing parameters that we have to keep in place. So I hope you look forward to seeing the rest of this video that will show you how you get to class. Thank you. When our elementary students arrive on campus, there will be signs showing them where to line up. Each student will be six feet apart. That way we maintain social distancing. Uh, they'll begin by walking up these stairs and there'll be arrows and social distancing markers showing where they stand, and where they go. And as you can see, they'll turn the corner over here. Now we had to create a line like this to ensure that we're keeping our social distancing expectations while getting all students in. Uh, parents, it's important that you also fill out your frontline information on students. That's the pre-screening prior to them coming in because once, if that's done, they'll walk into this door. Someone will be here with the door open. Uh, they'll stand in front of this machine right here. Now this machine is your temperature check. If you get the green like I got right here, that means I'm good to go and then they will walk on through. Now keep in mind these doors will be open so it will be easier to get in. So front line is good, my temperature is good, I am able to walk on in. Now if I'm a kindergarten student, this is where I'll be headed. I'll be walking right on over here and there'll be social distancing markers to line up in front of Mrs. Whitmore's class. Now if I'm a first or second grade student, once I'm going campus, I'll hang a right. And we'll actually have a yellow brick road that shows our students how to get to class on the first couple days. That way they know exactly where to go. And there'll be plenty of adults out to help, like Mr. Bagby, who you saw our custodian, who's over there to the right. So once they walk through here, they'll hang a left. And you'll see the first and second grade classes are the first ones on the left. So we have our second graders there with Mrs. Lopez. And we have our first grade classroom right here with Mrs. Rangels. So looking at the ground, you see the social distancing markers. It gives you an idea of how students will line up. They're all six feet apart. I hope everyone enjoyed the mini tour of how to get to class on our first day back in our hybrid format. As a reminder, parents, it is really important that you finish that frontline pre-screening every morning prior to sending your child to school. We need two things to get every child on school. The first thing is the pre-screening, the second thing is that temperature check. If students aren't pre-screened in the morning uh, by you, we will have to do that here at the school, which will hold up the line. Uh, please contact the school if you have any questions on how to complete that. And let's all remember to win the day. Thank you.